The Netherlands plans to start supply of F-16 fighter jets to Ukraine this autumn after a similar decision by Denmark, Dutch Defense Minister Kaisa Ollengren said during a briefing in Vilnius, according to Ukraine's European Pravda news outlet. Netherlands' decision to supply Ukraine with F-16s follows a similar decision by Denmark, which plans to transfer the planes in the summer. Ollengren stressed that this was a schedule for the supply of fighter jets to Ukraine, as prescribed by the Allies. We have everything planned according to the project, which consists of training Ukrainian pilots, training service personnel and handing over real aircraft, the minister said. Reminding that Ukrainian pilots are undergoing training in a number of countries, the Dutch minister said that if everything goes as planned, the first planes will be delivered by Denmark already this summer. We hope to participate in deliveries from autumn with our F-16s, the minister added. Earlier, Denmark's ambassador to Ukraine Ole Egbert Mikkelsen said he was optimistic about the arrival of F-16 fighters in Ukraine this summer. Neighboring Belgium has also accelerated the delivery of its own F-16 fighter jets to Ukraine by the end of 2024. According to media reports, the first F-16 fighter jets will appear in Ukrainian skies around in June 2024. Earlier, the United States announced that F-16 aircraft would start arriving in Ukraine this year with trained pilots. Ukraine will receive six TRML 4D radars from Germany. What they are needed for? Ukraine will receive additional six TRML 4D air surveillance radars for air defense needs from the German manufacturer Hensold. As reported by the company, the purchaser of the radars is the Ministry of Defense of Ukraine. However, payment for them will be made by the government of Germany as part of military aid. The cost of purchasing six TRML 4D radars amounts to over 100 million euros. The radars will be delivered to Ukraine later this year. TRML 4D radars are necessary to enhance the country's air defense capabilities. TRML 4D is a medium range C band radar from the TRML family developed in 2018. TRML 4D uses the latest digital radar technology. It is capable of detecting, tracking, and classifying different types of aerial targets. A focus is on small, fast and low-flying and or maneuvering cruise missiles as well as aircraft and helicopters. It ensures the rapid detection and tracking of about 1,500 targets in a radius of up to 250 kilometers. It is equipped with a phased array antenna with electronic scanning based on gallium nitride transmit receive modules. The system also has a mean time to repair of less than 0.5 hours and features built-in test equipment to ease maintenance and minimize downtime. Several systems are under contract to equip the Ukrainian air defense. A notable feature of the radar is its ability to operate autonomously and thus detect airborne targets. TRML 4D can interact with Iris T missile defense systems. Ukraine received its first TRML 4D radars back in October 2022. However, in April 2024, the German government announced that Ukraine was given one TRML 4D as part of the regular military aid package, although this could be a radar that was ordered as early as 2023. US military aid will reach Ukraine in a few months, by which time Russian attack will intensify. Sources among US and European officials have informed the New York Times that the US has supplied Ukraine with small batches from the first 1 billion euros military aid package announced after the funding was unblocked in Congress. However, the main batch from the large aid package will arrive in Ukraine in several months. The New York Times states that Ukraine received a batch of anti-tank missiles, ammunition and 155mm artillery rounds from the US as early as the 28th of April. The second batch of American aid arrived on the 29th of April. Next day, a new batch of Patriot interceptor missiles from Spain arrived in Poland on Tuesday. A senior Spanish official stated that they will be at the Ukrainian front soon. A part of new armament for Ukraine was delivered even before the announcements. A UK source told the New York Times that parts of the UK package announced on the 23rd of April by UK Prime Minister Rishi Sunak 
started arriving several weeks ago. Nonetheless, the bigger part of the weapons from large aid packages announced by the US, the UK and Germany will be delivered to Ukraine in a few months. The first reason is logistics. Combat vehicles, speedboats, modern guns, launchers and air defense systems are often transported by sea and by train with enhanced security due to their size. An American official told the New York Times that most of the large weapons and even a part of ammunition will be sent from the US and will most likely be delivered by the middle of summer, if not later. Moreover, the American side is yet to determine where it can get the equipment promised for Ukraine in a way so as not to endanger the combat ability of NATO units using it. On the 24th of April, US President Joe Biden signed legislation enacted by Congress that offers about 61 billion US dollars in new military and economic aid to Ukraine as well as help to other US allies.